Thank you so much for tuning in. My daughter recently moved into a one bedroom apartment and had zero to furnish or use in her place. And to my very great delight, she asked me to help her with that. So in this video, I'm gonna show you how we got her apartment up to speed from scratch. There's actually two videos. This one, we're gonna talk about how we did it using resale to start with. And then we have a second one where we show you how we incorporated some new things and we'll show you the finished result. But first, thank you so much for tuning in. I really appreciate it. If you are a regular viewer and subscriber, I absolutely love you. Thank you so much. If you are new to the channel, please subscribe if you like what you're seeing. It's just a button here trying to grow it. We are also on all the social media outlets, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, at the dress up mom hashtag the dress up mom and you can check us out there too since my daughter became an adult she has definitely lived in a bunch of different places but most of the places have been furnished already or she's had like little bits of pieces but she just came back to the states after spending a couple years abroad living in dublin ireland and when she came back here to san diego she basically had two suitcases just with clothes and shoes. She had virtually nothing for an apartment except for this one pretty cool blanket that she bought in Portugal, but she was starting from scratch. So when she found this really cute one bedroom apartment that she wanted to move into, she knew it was kind of her first really adult place that she could furnish however she wanted and she wanted to do it kind of nicely now she did not have a huge budget she didn't want to spend a ton of money on it and really kind of didn't know where to start so she asked me for my help yay and i have had so much fun working with her on this spending her money on it and it was really kind of cool being able to start it from scratch. I think the way to go, regardless of your budget, is to start looking at resale. Now, there are some great consignment places that have furniture, and it's usually really nicer pieces, either old or even just nicer new pieces that you can get at such an amazing discount. That's where we started. I'm gonna take you in this video and talk you through what we did at a place in San Diego called Consignment Classics. We found a bunch of pieces there. We also found a really cool one at one of my favorite vintage places, Bad Match. So let's just get through this resale portion of Tiana's apartment. Our first stop was Consignment Classics in Encinitas, a place where I have had a lot of luck finding really cool things. It is huge and there is literally something for every single room and the things are really nice. There's a lot of new things mixed in with older vintage pieces. They do a really good job picking the things in this shop and it's in a nicer part of town so you get some things I think from very nice homes. And I took Tiana here first and we did a peruse of the entire space before we really started settling in and looking to see what might be great for her place. She spotted this coffee table made out of wood and fell in love with it and it really became the cornerstone of the entire decor that we pulled together for her place. It's the centerpiece. I can't even imagine what this cost originally. Then she really liked these circled mirrors that we thought we could incorporate well, sort of a nautical rustic look and feel to them. And this is her dining room table which had underneath it an original tag of $5,000. She paid significantly less for it, of course, but look at the wooden inlays into this flower shape, and it is just beautiful. It pulls out, it also pulls in. We next started to look for some chairs for that table. There were a lot of different options, not many that were super comfortable, but she did find two of these really rustic, nice, comfortable ones that we decided to pick up for the table. So this is what we ended up getting here at the first stop, and you'll see she's quite pleased with it. I'm so pleased. I love, I, I love everything, but like look at this table is amazing. 
The table was the first thing that got me. I was just like, yes, I have to have it. It was just perfect. And then we can kind of, we kind of built around that. I also love these mirrors, so that came together. And then mom found the table, because originally we sort of overlooked that, but then it pulls out, and we realized it really goes nicely with everything. And then the chairs came last, which I think really go well, and they're comfortable, and they're so pretty. Yay! Since we had so much luck at the Consignment Classics in Encinitas, the following weekend we decided to check out the one that is in our downtown area. And it was also chock full with all sorts of goodies for every room in the house, including accessories, everything that you can imagine. This one was even bigger. It had this whole downstairs area and outside area. And we were pretty impressed here as well. My husband helped her buy a TV and we needed a TV stand or something to put the TV on. And it was kind of a weird measurement that we needed, but look at this piece. We found the perfect piece for her TV there. And then we love these two lamps. They also had a nice design and were really good with her color scheme and everything that was going on in the place. And then Tiana found these really cool, like standing bookshelves almost in a nice dark color to elevate and look up and she could put different uh, pieces on top of there. So we really loved that. And her favorite thing was this Mexican chimney that she just fell in love with. I told her I'd be coming over for some s'mores in that chimney. We loaded up her Prius, and somehow the people there, they were so wonderful and helped us get everything in. It all fit, and we headed back over to her place. Here you can see how perfectly that TV fit on the stand that we found for hardly anything. There's her lovely Mexican chimney that we're going to have a lot of fun with in the summer. These are some paintings that actually were from my parents' place that she ended up taking when we cleared out their house, and they also go perfectly now with the color scheme. So things were definitely starting to come together. I found this beautiful marble top credenza that was resale at Bad Madge that is perfect for her bedroom. I also found this stool that she uses to put her shoes on in her entryway, and these two really well-made, beautiful ottoman at a great price from my sister's attic. Well, that's it for this time. I think we found some amazing pieces to build off of here. In the next video that we do on her place in a couple weeks, I'll show you how we then went and incorporated new pieces that she needed to have. And we'll show you the big reveal at the end. Spoiler alert, she loves it and it looks great. Thank you so much for watching. Until next time, have fun and Dress it up a little.